Minister Tumi here. For those of you that don't know me, I am a 24 time track record setter and holder, and this is the car that I do it in. And today we are going to late model engines in Houston, Texas to drop off our engine. Um, right now we're sitting in traffic. I got a Red Bull in hand, and uh, let's get this drive knocked out. engine is a 427 uh, built uh, RHS block from late model engines um, they are the ones who really make the, the heart of, of the car the science behind it all is is their recipe for 2,000 horsepower um, it's it's their 2,000 horsepower package and we only run it at a thousand <laughs> With that combination, we've been able to run, you know, I think three seasons now. Um, and every every season uh, during the off time, I, I take the engine and I send it to them to get rebuilt, refreshed, just to make sure that, you know, everything's happy and healthy. And, you know, I don't go uh, all winter without knowing that there's a problem. And I go to my first event and the thing blows up. So to prevent that from happening, I take the precautions of, you know, rebuilding it uh, during the off season, you know, they inspect it, they, they tear it down, they put new rings, uh, bearings, and if something needs to be replaced, like valve springs or, you know, whatever, um, they, they go ahead and do that. So just a part of my program that I have kind of made it um, a habit of doing and I think because of doing that that is why we have such a reliable uh, engine package uh, we do push a lot of horsepower and, and torque and heat through this thing so it makes the absolute you know most sense to to do it to me um, it is money it's money spent um, so like I could see why somebody would you know not want to do it but I I like having a reliable car, um, you know, cars at, at this level and this much power going through it. I think uh, it's just one of the wear and tear items that you kind of need to have to replace and, and kind of take care of. So um, that being said, they have done an amazing job with this uh, engine package for the car. We, the, we've had zero issues. I think the only time we've ever had a problem was a tuning base problem. Um, Besides that, you know, the thing has, has always worked great, um, made amazing power, and uh, so it's, it's just been a really great package. Um, the guys at LME are, are great. They work their magic. Um, they've, they've always been amazing to work with. And, uh, you know, when we, when we get there, I'm gonna give you guys a shop tour, kind of show you all the things that's going on. They have some crazy CNC machines. Um, they're, they're making like their own uh, billet blocks now as well. Um, so I'll give you guys a quick shop tour. I don't think I really want to, you know, sit there and, and waste anybody's time and, and talk to them for, for my little videos. But um, I'll just give you guys a quick walk around to show you the, their setup and, and how their operation um, is kind of is set up. So uh, with that being said, let's uh, finish up this drive and get the engine over to LME. Welcome to LME. Uh, as you walk in here, you see all the different heads on display and some products that they make here in-house. And if you enter to the left, you go through their assembly room. This is where they do their final assembly on all their engines. Really clean, well-organized area. I was lucky enough to catch these guys at lunch, so I got to just walk around and do my thing without bugging anybody. 
making your way towards the back we have fully assembled engines we have a bunch of in stock products and then all the different machinery uh, lme uses here um, LME does everything in-house under one roof in Houston, Texas, which is amazing to see. Um, and uh, if you make your way towards the back, you see their new billet aluminum block in front of us. Um, again, crazy cool to see a billet aluminum block being made here uh, in Houston, Texas. So uh, making your way around to the left here, we have more one-off products uh, unique to LME. We have a bunch of heads getting uh, ready to be worked on. And then in this CNC machine here, you can see a head being worked on right now. So uh, I believe they have about nine or 10 CNC machines. These things run 24 seven and uh, they just, you know, are doing what LME does, busting out product. So um, I've had the absolute pleasure to be working with these guys for the past three years now. Um, you know, we've had some really great reliability and we've made some really high horsepower numbers. So a lot to be said. Uh, I mean, we torture these things. We're not running this, this engine for seconds at a time or running it for minutes at a time. And to be able to make high horsepower all year long like that and not have to open the engine up and, and rebuild it throughout the season. Uh, that's a lot to be said for the guys here at LME that are building these engines. So thank you guys so much. Uh, for doing such an amazing job and for keeping us uh, on track and, and going. So um, I think I'm going to end this video here. Uh, if you guys like this video, please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Game over. Oh, man. Oh. All right. What can I do now? Tedges. Thank you.